This is Kafumbe Mkasa Road in downtown Kampala in 2014. The place previously littered with garbage by the roadside has been transformed into a modern business center over the last few years. The developments on Kafumbe Mkasa Road have also spread to other slums around Kampala's central division, such as Nachivubo, Kayutunsi, Namirembe Road, Chisenyi, among others. The workers and residents in these areas appreciate the role the development has played in changing their lives, especially in reducing crime. It's good. It's good. It's very good. It has helped us just chase some thieves and whatever. Yeah. The place was so ramshackled. It was a bit filthy. But when you can see the place now, it is clean, it is smart, there is some order. Number one, all the thieves, the thugs, belong to Kisei. That was the hub. The drug addicts, Kisei. Any bad activity is Kisei. But today, as I talk, Kisei has been transformed. Even the, 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 the so-called thieves, we have tried to transform them. They're becoming now responsible citizens. The developers believe if there is goodwill from the political leadership of Kampala, more can be achieved. But Salim Uhuru, one of the leaders in Chisenyi, claims the development has left many squatters and tenants landless, especially after proper developers acquire land titles from landlords. When the investor comes, the amount of money he wishes to give you is not worth relocating you. Because he would come, uh, if he buys it from uh, Buganda Land Board, he has all the titles and everything. But when it comes to pay you, he doesn't have, take you as someone so important. So that's the challenge we had. Much as the traders are appreciating this new development in the city, they are complaining about the high rent fees charged by the landlords, likely to chase them out of business. Investors have built properties, but they're building it for, for us. So that is the only challenge we are facing. High rental costs on those properties. You see, very nice in town. Habad Ziwa, NTV.